What's going on the guys, Croco here, and I am happy and sad at the same time. Welcome to my very last episode of Dark Souls. Uh, let's play of this Dark Souls Let's Play. Um, it was a hell of a ride. Thank you very much for sticking by. And let's just see how many times it's going to take me to beat the final boss. And of course, as this is our last episode of this Let's Play, um, if you could for me leave a like button, leave a like button, leave a click the like button, that would be fantastic. And just leave your guys' comment, did you enjoy the series? That would be awesome. I'm starting a brand new let's play, maybe today or even or tomorrow, we shall see. Um, and then it's straight on to Dark Souls 2. I cannot wait. So without further ado, let's get going. So if you guys remember on the last episode we have beaten the four kings. And now we go here. That was a pretty uh, cool place, and it has uh, some pretty chill music in the background. Creepy chill music in the background. Let's just let's just call it that. So you guys see a bunch of uh, silver knights just chilling, walking. We can't go there. <laughs> we have to go here. This is the kiln of the first flame. It's awesome, and I'm not going to speed run this. I am going to kill every single enemy. And then, if I do end up dying, which is most likely the case, on the last boss, I will just speedrun it and, you know, just cut it. Let's see if we can uh, flinch him. Uh, the reason why I kind of want to show you guys all these knights is for one simple reason. If you want to get your stuff for New Game Plus, I suggest farming it here. So what do you pick up? Pick up the Titanite chunk, and every time you die, and every time these guys respawn, they give you a different type of Titanite chunk. We're gonna have regular, we're gonna have uh, blue Titanite chunks, just, just, you wait and see. It's pretty cool, um, so I just wanna show you guys. Yeah, this, doing this Let's Play, I'm telling you guys, I've been on YouTube for a pretty long time, it's creeping up on five years, and I gotta say, it's awesome. It's been a hell of a ride doing this Let's Play. Um... See, with, with me being a Call of Duty gamer and just FPS in general, it just... The, the FPS market got, has gotten so stale, so, so saturated, that it, sometimes it felt like I was forced to create a video. And it, this didn't happen, like, you know, a year ago or whatever. And this happened, I, I realized that, like, a month ago, maybe. Maybe just over a month and a half ago, when ghosts got boring to me. Believe it, and there's a motorcycle outside. Awesome. Yeah, buddy. Uh, so, yeah, so... I thought to myself, well, if Ghost is my favorite Call of Duty... Um, one of my favorite Call of Duties right after Black Ops, and that got boring, what the hell is going on? You know what I mean? So, it was like a realization of... There's other stuff out there. And maybe I got... A bit late uh, to the to the let's play party, but trust me when I tell you guys that this has been really awesome creating this let's play for you. This is like one of my favorite games of all time, and I've just been enjoying the hell out of it. So thank you very much for the support, by the way. Um, if you know anybody that enjoys Dark Souls, would like to see Dark Souls 2, uh, be sure to let them know because I cannot wait to start doing the um, the let's play. Ah, oh, man. Hell of a ride. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Hopefully you guys too. Okay, so we have a couple of more knights, silver knights to beat. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay, we took care of them. See, in the beginning when I first got to this part, I was like, oh man, because I thought the game was gonna end, right? Because I got the Lord Souls. This is like my first Let's Play. Um, I got all the Lord Souls and, and I came to this place and I saw it and I was like, wow, no way, this is going to be like another Anne Orlando like, with so much shit to do. But unfortunately it turns out that there's not that much to do. You can just basically farm Titanite chunks and the boss gate is actually, this is the arena, right there, right in front of us. Uh, the fog gate is right there. So I was a little bit disappointed, but the game, I'm telling you guys, this is one of the most addicting games in history. Loved it. So again, if you never played it, oh, that was a sweet attack. If you never played it, give it a shot. It's awesome. I don't know if he can parry me. I forgot. Okay, but he's dead. What do we get? 
White Titanite Chunk. Okay. Let's heal up. Um, for the last part, <laughs> you don't really need armor. You, you just don't because there's a trick to doing this. Oh, he's actually using my favorite weapon. One of my favorite weapons, actually. The Halbert. Right in a dick. Look at that. You saw that? Oh, man. Too much health. Such bulk. Okay, I'm gonna die by this fucker. No, I'm not. What do we get? Blue Titanite Chunk. Okay. So we kind of want to limit the amount of Estus Flask we use. But then again, this is not gonna matter. Okay, guys, are you ready? Are you ready to see the final boss in Dark Souls? Um, and also to all of you wondering if I'm going to do the DLC. Probably not, because if there's one thing that I want to... Or you guys experience on your own without any walkthrough is the DLC like the main game I can do but the DLC I want you guys to experience on your own it's really really awesome and it's definitely worth the money so with that being said let's go this music is fucking awesome okay there's a trick no nope not like this Stop grabbing me, you bitch! Oops, okay. Okay! Awesome. Not awesome. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Damn, look at his reach. And he still didn't manage to, uh... Mmm. Okay, well... Fucking bitch. Well... <laughs> there you go. Oh, hell of a try. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I just wanted to see, um, like, his pattern, what is he gonna do. He usually just swings the sword, but for some reason, uh, Gwen decided to just wail on me with the, with the, you know, grappling attack, and that kind of threw me off, uh, off, off guard, but that's okay! Let's see if we can, uh, do round number two. I'm guessing there's gonna be a lot of rounds. So the trick to beating Gwen is you have to parry him. You don't have to have to you can fight him legit but you're going to have such a goddamn headache after you defeat him i did defeat gwen just mano y mano you know sword versus sword but it was just holy shit it was crazy and a new game new game like plus 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 out of all the things so oops i forgot about this guy you want to be super careful here uh, Speedrunning this is <laughs> fairly straightforward. Just be sure to have your Estus flasks out because you might get jabbed. So the thing with Gwen, you have to parry him. That's the best way and the most convenient way to defeat him, basically. He doesn't give you a lot of time to heal, so that's unfortunate. But, you know, that's just something you have to deal with. Let's go! Round two! Come on, Gwen, you son of a bitch. Okay, see, this is the type of shit... What is he doing? Stop it. Oh my god, just swing! I think we broke Gwyn. Okay, that was uh, legit. See, that's not doing, like... No damage, it's doing some damage, but not, like, too much. Oh god, fantastic.
Oh man, that took a while. Holy crap. Yep, guys, uh, we got the final final uh, Lord Soul. Uh, Soul of Gwyn. That took us a while. Um, <laughs> hopefully you enjoyed the series. Well, there's two types of ways we can end this. With a bad ending, leaving here. Or with the good ending. And you know what? I think we're going to do the good ending. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this series. Enjoy the cutscene. Thank you very much for participating. Thank you very much for viewing. Uh, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to this channel for more awesome Let's Plays. Thank you so much, guys. See you next time.